What time is it? Uh oh. I'm sitting here running my mouth. Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Kyra Sean. Welcome back to another edition of Wigmas. And today's video is brought to you by Wild African. They were kind of to send me another unit to review for you guys. I also have another Wig Bay Holiday Slay to share with y'all. And this one comes from my girl, Deidre. Tell me she don't look fire. You li listen. <laughs> The hair color, the makeup, the dress, sis is looking good. So Deidre says when she found this synthetic wig in her local beauty supply store, she had to have it. Not only was the color combo gorgeous, but the price was as well, $20. Wait a minute, what? And she says, yes, you heard it correctly. Okay, sis. <laughs> The ginger and yellow was yelling at me. I love it and I love your channel. Now she doesn't recall the name of her unit because it was on the clearance table. However, if you check out your local beauty supply store, they may have one just like this, okay? Y'all know they famous for putting, you know, the oldies but goodies on the clearance racks and forgetting about them. Okay, listen, Deidre said forget me not, okay? Because we not gonna forget her in this joint. You hear me? So make sure y'all show Deidre some love down below. I'm sure she will appreciate it. As always, before we get into my install, the specs and what I think about the unit straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. In my heart But this year I Wanna 
Okay, so like I said, this unit comes to us from Wild African. It is their Thick Density Body Wave unit. It comes in a natural color, and the starting price for my unit is right here on the screen. Now, I'm pretty sure they have a sale going on right now, so y'all know I got you with the coupon code, okay? Check that joint out down below. Say them coins. If you guys send this week to the Sneaky Link Sugar Bay or Daddy Papa, send the coupon code too, okay? Let them know you're trying to help them out, okay? Save them coins, so then they can help you out. You, you hear what I'm saying? Okay, it's a win-win. <laughs> y'all know Daddy Papa like them sales, okay? <laughs> Now depending on the specs you get for this unit, the price can go up. The main thing I will say for this unit is the lace and the hairline. While African has never steered me wrong when it comes to the lace and the hairline for my units, I have tried their invisible Swiss lace before with the regular hairline, no problem whatsoever. However, they are introducing their new lace, which is HD film lace. Like a movie? Yeah, film. <laughs> I don't know what HD film lace is, but I know what it isn't and it's not ashy, okay? The invisible Swiss lace is better than normal lace and a little bit thinner and also is more natural. Nothing is wrong with this lace, it melts down just as fine. It may be a little bit thicker than the HD film lace, but nothing, you know, super crazy. When it comes to the HD film lace, it's thinner than the Swiss lace and even more natural than the Swiss lace. So basically the lace blends down better and better the thinner the lace gets. So you can get this unit with the HD film lace normal hairline or you can get this unit with the HD film lace clean hairline. Now when it comes to normal hairlines and clean hairlines, I feel like the main difference is how much you pluck the unit and how much you bleach the knots. I'm pretty sure I got the HD film lace with the clean hairline and y'all this is sitting real nice on me. Now as you can see on me at 5'6", I'm sitting with some inches, okay? But if this is too long for you, you can definitely get a shorter length. This unit does come in 14 to 22 inches as well as 150% density. I thought the 150 was going to be a little bit too thin for me. Normally when I get to longer lengths, I like my unit to be a little bit thicker. However, this is considered their thick density unit. So even at 150, it does give off like a 180 feel, but you know, this is still cute. Now I didn't co-wash my unit, but I did spray her down with some dry shampoo just because it did come with a slight chemical smell and I didn't want to smell that around my face. I would suggest you wash your unit, which will also alleviate some of the steps that I did in my unit. As you saw on my put down, I had to go in and straighten out my unit before I put my curls in because this unit did come in a body wave texture. So the curl was still in my unit. So I had to straighten that out and then go back in and put the curls in where I wanted my unit. Because this unit is pretty long, I would definitely suggest you go in and set your curls. You guys saw that I didn't do that. I just kind of curled mine, let it sit for a little bit, and then I pretty much combed them out. Pin your curls and set them to make sure that your curls last a little bit longer. Also, because this unit is a lot longer, you may want to go in and cut some layers around the unit just to give it more body and shape, which will also allow your curls to hold a little bit better. When it's all one length, the unit is pretty heavy, so you know the curls kind of fall a lot faster. So be mindful of that. I mean, I should have cut some layers into this unit but mm, I did it <laughs> Now, you can wear this unit glueless because of that elastic band that it comes with, it's pretty sturdy. When I put it on, it was sitting pretty good. However, for the look that I wanted, I wanted to make sure it was behind my ear and I didn't want to have no trouble on the sides. Now, my unit does stop a little short on the sides. It doesn't come all the way down onto my ear tabs because of how the elastic band is kind of pulling the unit back. I'm not wearing my wig grip for the sake of space, but if I didn't spray my unit down, I would definitely rock my wig grip just to make sure my unit was more secure. So I would definitely say this unit is more big head associate than big head friendly based on how it's fitting on my sides, but the comfort level still feels feels big head friendly. I didn't get no shedding or tangling with this unit. This unit is pretty much like, I have no complaints. This hairline is looking bomb. You hear me? Do y'all see how this hairline is looking on me? When it comes to parting spaces, wild African, unmatched. Okay, you're not running into tracks right away. There's a track right here, but see how much space I still have to do like, you know, a deeper side part if I wanted to? Listen, I love that, okay? I'm here for that. I'm here for my look, I'm here for my dress. Listen, Target needs to see me. Okay, I'm not playing, I got gifts to buy. The hair definitely feels real nice. It's more of a silky texture, so if you are not really into like a silky type of unit, um, this may not be for you. I'm still kind of confused on the HD film lace. I don't know if it's really HD lace or Swiss lace. Listen, I don't know, okay? Everything is blendable when it comes to me. <laughs> I'm gonna blend a wig, okay? It's never gonna be skin, but I'm gonna blend it as close as possible, okay? Listen, do we see how this is looking on me? Okay, I stay with the bars. I stay with the bars. <laughs> What time is it? Uh-oh. I gotta make sure I pick up my kids on time. 
<laughs> I'm sitting here running my mouth. But that is all I got for you guys today. Shout out one more time to Wild African for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. I will put the direct link as well as my specs down below. So if you guys want to check this unit out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.